What's going on, YouTubers? Welcome to another video. Today is July 1st, so in typical fashion, we're going to talk about some of the statues I received last month, my favorite, and what you can anticipate from the next month. So it looks like uh, what we got was Steppenwolf, Doctor Strange, Galvatron, got some uh, free lightsabers for promotion, Harley Quinn, the Trinity Plaques, uh, sort of fixed my Aquaman arm. And that was kind of it. So obviously, Doctor Strange was the best, no doubt. Second being Steppenwolf, and then Galvatron. So yeah, Doctor Strange was definitely a huge highlight. Uh, that piece is absolutely crazy good. And Steppenwolf is absolutely amazing. But July is definitely going to be absolutely jam-packed, filled with so many statues, it's not even funny. I have right now 14 tracking numbers. I don't think I've ever had that many at the exact same time. Uh, and more than likely, all 14 are going to be arriving during the month of July. So massive, massive month. We have so much going on. Before we get to that, make sure you subscribe to the channel. You know, like this video, hit that bell notification so you get notified whenever I post new content. And be sure to check out in the description below all my preferred sellers and everything. So first, let's get to all the statues we're going to be receiving. Alrighty, so this might be the first one we get, if not the second, because I did just have something DHL shipped to me. But Godzilla vs. Kong. I am beyond excited for this because it has the potential to become the best statue ever created for me. You know, in terms of statue, not life-size busts. Uh, I like to separate those two. They're so different. You can't really compare them. But when it comes to a statue, currently Jetwing Optimus is my favorite, and then Prime 1 Jungle Hunter Predator, and then Wonder Woman on horse, and then Shockwave. This one, I think, can top them all. It ships in five boxes. So that's one reason I have so many tracking numbers. Uh, but five boxes, beyond excited. It should arrive. should really hit customs any day now. Gimli. Uh, so we just paid for Gimli, uh, although I don't think he'll arrive during July. I think he will, he will be one. He's not one I have tracking for yet. But if Prime wanted to ship him in the next few days, he could arrive towards the end of July. But Gimli is paid. I'm super excited because I have literally wanted a Gimli since I started collecting. When I first got in collecting, I started getting Lord of the Rings statues almost immediately. And I was always super disappointed we never got a Gimli. I was like, what the fuck? We have... Aragorn and Legolas, but no Gimli. You're missing the Holy Trinity. It's like having a, you know, a Batman and Wonder Woman with no Superman. You gotta have all three. So I'm very happy Prime One made us a killer Gimli. Queen Alien Bust, I do have tracking. Should arrive hopefully within the month of July. It did just ship a few days ago, but I am super excited for this one. Does ship in two massive boxes. Got it from our good friends over at Spec Fiction. So, very excited for this. I did opt to do sea shipping instead of waiting for his container so I could get it quicker. J&D Mera, she is set to ship end of July is what, uh, you know, Todd at Spec told me. So, very excited to add her, you know, so she'll be one of the final statues of the month. Kid Link 1 uh, This is currently just stuck in customs per the tracking number I got. <clears throat> So, realistically, it should get out any day now, and then we should get it, but very excited to get Kid Link. Vegeta Headholder. Just paid for this, actually, and I'm going to do air shipping since it's so small, but very excited to add this. It's not a massive piece, but it's so crucial to my display, so very excited to add this. Krillin. Uh, he shipped, like, a week and a half or two weeks ago, and it was... Uh, ETA is three weeks, they said, so he should arrive in the next, like, week and a half or two weeks. But very excited to add him. You know, I sold my old Krillin in anticipation of this one. And it's funny, uh, the moment this one starts to ship, another studio is doing literally almost the exact same scene and everything. But they made a superior base and an underbase, although no logo. An underbase, frankly, is just black. It sucks. But a slightly better, you know, like, base and aura. However, the actual Krillin... Uh, is not as good. So I still think this is the superior one because the character ultimately takes precedence over that slightly better base. And I'm going to add an under base with a logo anyways. Uh, my custom Chucky doll. So uh, mine's being finished up right now. Like the actual doll is finished, 
What we're waiting for is he's building <clears throat> some additional hands, like swap out hands. My last Chucky, like custom one, literally had like no knife holding hand, just two hands. I had to use like a putty to stick a knife in it or angle it, you know, like a cupping to be able to have him hold anything. It was annoying. So this one, I'm going all out, folks. He is doing like six pairs of hands. We're getting a flipping off FU hand a knife hand for both hands and tons of hands, a fist hand. So very excited. It's gonna be you know superior in every way than my previous Chucky doll. So very excited to get him and he should be shipping any day and he'll only take it, you know, he'll get here quickly. Captain America life-size bus by Queen Studios. This bad boy should arrive around the mid July. <clears throat> uh, according to Bruce Way, where I ordered, link in the description below. He can help you get Infinity and Queen products uh, out of China. But he said, like, July 7 or something like that, it's supposed to hit port. So if that's accurate, then realistically, I should probably get this around mid-July. But I am super excited for Captain Bust. I'm honestly surprised Queen was shipping this so early. I honestly was thinking, yeah, Captain won't ship till end of year. Then all of a sudden he's ready like weeks later. I'm like, what the fuck? So after we get him, all we need is Thor bust. So I don't know when Thor's set to ship. I've asked Queen, but I'm still estimating him end of year, which is fine. Gives me time to save the money for him. But s sooner the better, because I freaking want that Thor. But Captain, ultimately, I think will be one of the and last but not least, we're going to be getting this link on Epona one fourth scale. So if you guys all remember, I used to have the Lincoln Opponent one six scale by first four figures. It was from Twilight Princess. It was great. Uh, I had it for many, many years and I sold it for like $2,600 or something. I also sold my, you know, Lincoln Loftwing, Lincoln Red Lion, you know, from Wind Waker and Skyward Sword. But now we're getting this one, the original 3D Zelda that really started it all for me. Cause you know, like I definitely loved, loved Link to the Past. I think it was my favorite game on, you know, SNES. But, you know, I, I feel like for a lot of people in my general age growing up, playing Ocarina of Time was like a game changer. It truly revolutionized video games for us from that SNES era. And so I've played this game a dozen times and, you know, my buddy got this in hand. This is actually his photo. And he told me, dude, you have got to get this. It is incredible and massive. So here we are. We pulled the trigger and it's actually being shipped DHL. So I'll have this one next week. Uh, if we, so it's either gonna be this or Godzilla vs Kong that will arrive next. But very excited to get this ordered through our good friends at Kyo Nation. Uh, I already got tracking day next. And so, very excited to get this. If you guys are also unaware, Kyo Nation is now, you know, the second official seller of DBZ Resin Collectors as the preferred seller. So, them and Hexapus are the two, you know, vendor sellers of my group, you know, where we have over 20,000 members. So, that is the best place to buy DBZ and anime statues in general. Those two, you know, are the best. Anyways, folks, this is kind of what we got going, although...